Okay, well, um, the right answer here is D. Remember, percent variance explained is about correlation squared. All right, now one correlation is negative 0.5 and the other correlation is 0.5, but both of them, when you square, you get 0.25 or 25%. So they actually are both explaining the same amount of variance. Okay, make sure you understand that concept. Please let me know if you have any questions. Now, follow the link below this video to move on to the final question, which is number 11.